coming back this season has been great. Hey. Preacher is just even more Preacher than ever this year. It starts at about 90 miles an hour, and then it adds about 15 miles an hour per episode, and it just keeps speeding up and getting crazier and spinning and spinning. It's just one thing after another. Everything screeches to a stop. You have this moment, and then it's just like, Fans can expect to see a lot of peculiar characters even further in Garth's imagination than any of the ones that we saw last year. Miss Maureen! Miss Maureen! Look what the cat cover! These strange, flawed, funny, often disgusting and hateful people that you just can't help but sort of be hooked on. We're in a totally new world of the bayou and Jesse's haunted upbringing. Grandma! something to really get your teeth into. This is way off the chart in terms of what people thought they could do with this genre. We are introduced to Angelville, the home of the Langelles, and Jesse's ancestral home. His only choice to save Tulip has been to come and find this heinous family which he's lived his entire life trying to stay away from. Coming back to Angelville it troubles him because it holds a mirror up to who he might be and who he doesn't really want to be. It's about the identity of who are my people? Who do I most fit with? Grandma loves you. How does he disentangle himself? New alliances, pragmatic decisions about people that one needs to make friends with. Whoops. We're super excited to see how people respond to them. Just like old time, right, kid? This show is genuinely not like anything else any of us have been involved in. That's season three. That was faster than I anticipated. I'm on my way.